you, you even quoted out of the book of Moses and say that you imitate him by washing your feet and so on. Perfectly correct. But now why do you fail to follow the rest of the commands of the tabernacle? Yeah. And this is why I would say that it is another gospel because there's nothing, you have nothing in, in Islam that continues the tabernacle worship or the commands of God. So how can you say you please God because how can you say you are in submission to God? Right. If you do not... Right. You see, Jesus there. Christ... So, no, but what I'm trying to say is on the basis of, of the Torah, mm -hmm. this is certainly another gospel. The New Testament is another gospel. No. Circumcision, circumcision, part of the Torah. Circumcision. Romans, Romans 1 says, no? Paul says that the gospel is based on the holy prophets. <laughs> right, right. He doesn't give his basis for the gospel on the other gospels. He gives his basis for the gospel that he preached. What did Jesus say? Yeah. No, no, what did Jesus say? He says, think not that I am come to destroy the law of the prophets. Exactly. I am come not to destroy but to fulfill. For verily I say unto you, heaven and earth shall pass away, but one jot or one tittle shall in no wise pass from the law so till all be fulfilled. Those. Whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments, or shall teach men so, shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. Amen. But whosoever shall teach and do shall be called great. Yes. So I am asking you, born again Christians, do you follow the laws and the commandments? Yes. 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 We, we, Are you all circumcised, you males? Are you circumcised? When Jesus was circumcised, when, yes, I'm circumcised. When Jesus was circumcised, with the hands of God. No, no, no the Bible the says. Your Bible says, when Jesus was circumcised, he was circumcised on the eighth day on the flesh of his foreskin. Yes, right. You know what's foreskin? Yeah. The skin in front of the male organ. Yeah. That was cut off. Circum means right round, and size means to cut. That was cut off, not the heart of Jesus. Yes, exactly. So, but, so, but what you just no, said no, is no, Jesus no. fulfilled. So in other words, He's brought no, no, His no. law to fulfillment. Yes. So, so in other words, we are not no, just no, in the law. No, no, no. We no, are now in the no, fulfillment no, no. of the law if, and of the promises. No, no, you are not following His commandments. He said, "Verily, very, very I say unto you, except your righteousness exceed." Yeah. The righteousness of the scribes and the Pharisees, ye yes. shall by no means enter the kingdom of heaven. Yes. There is no heaven for you, unless you are better than the Jew. Yes. Now, how can you be better than the Jew by not keeping the laws and the commandments? The law says that every male child shall be circumcised in the flesh of his foreskin on the eighth day. And you as a Christian, you are talking about the heart. They are talking about the foreskin. The covenant that God entered with Abraham was the foreskin, not the heart. As an outward mark of your submission. But our to baptism the now Abraham, the same there was purpose. promise. A big one. Our baptism now has that doesn't been. circumcise that foreskin. You still carry the land there around with you, man. Can't you see? <laughs> you still look. God Almighty <laughs> gave you a commandment. He says, "Cut it off." This is a sign between me and you, and the descendants of Abraham. And you create, claim to be a spiritual children of, of Abraham. Yes. 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 Now, so as a spiritual children, you must keep his commandments. Yes. To Jesus Christ, Christ Jesus right. Christ, he said, he is not of me who does not take his cross and follow me. Yes. Take up your cross and yes. follow me. Yes. Means what I do, you do. As I am circumcised, you be circumcised. Yes. As I abstain from the pig, you abstain from the pig. Everything that I do, you do. You follow me. When you say you follow him, means you do everything that he does. Now, we Muslims are the nearest to following Jesus. Whatever he does, you say we are prepared to do. What did he do? What did he say? What we must do? We are prepared to do. You, with your lips, you say you are following him, but in your actions, you are belying.